Welcome back to Sweet Beat TV. I'm your host, Sienna Leone, and today I'm joined by beauty influencer and YouTuber, Marielle Marrero. Hi, Marielle, how are you? Hi, guys. <laughs> Marielle, I kind of want to dive in here. I mean, I love your content. You have Yo. such amazing content from Instagram, YouTube, you name it. So I kind of want to know a little bit more about you and your story of how you got into the makeup and beauty industry. I started 10 years ago. I started creating content a long time ago. It was not a cool thing to do. It was actually a very weird thing. <laughs> People were like, what do you mean you talk to the camera and put makeup on? Like, right. who does that? <laughs> and, and just kind of slowly grew. I created content in Spanish at first, and then we moved to the US, so we moved here. And I was like, well, I gotta talk to someone in English. I gotta practice that. So I created a channel in English, and it's just kind of slowly grown. I've never had like a viral moment, sadly. <laughs> Tell us why you made two different channels serving two different audiences. It's hard because when you're an immigrant, you can really see like both sides, even with like memes, like the memes are completely different in English and in Spanish. So I was like, okay, I need to create content that will be relevant to kind of like each person. And as someone who you know grew up in Latin America and then moved here, you have like those two sides to you and those are both you but then i kind of get to show each side on each channel so for me it's a lot of fun you know it's like multiple personalities but not okay. really <laughs> i want to talk a little bit on your recent collaboration palette with Too faced i personally love Too faced so i want to know marielle what was the inspiration behind this palette so for the palette, I really wanted the palette to like speak to both my audiences. So it's called Amor Caliente. I wanted it to be like very Latin and I called, I called both my audiences Amorcito. So I wanted that to be a part of it. I have my palette here. <laughs> so I wanted it to be very pink and Look at like, that. Really, so I love it. I think it looks so cute. It and so I want cute. it to be, thank you. Like a fun palette where you like have like daytime shades kind of and then like really fun the fun nighttime bright That's yeah crazy. <laughs> absolutely okay. Okay, now keep that open i want to know i know this is going to be super hard for you because i'm sure you love every color but no. i know <laughs> <laughs> I if you had to narrow it down to two of your favorite colors what would it be I, Cause every time I talk about the shade, I'm like, that's my favorite. That's my favorite. Right, right, right. <laughs> it I'm must change saying. every day too, you know? It does. I'm I will sure. say donut because I feel like I can use it a lot, which is like this, a little really shimmery. I don't know the shimmer. Yep. And you can see like my finger has it, like it's, I'm going to hit pan really soon on that one. <laughs> and then I'm going to say Amorcito, which is like this really bright pink. Uh-huh. My eye keeps uh, going to that. Really? Yeah. yeah. I have to like, that was the first shade where I was like, Too Faced, we gotta do this. And they actually had never used this formula on any palette before, so. Where can your fans and viewers watching this find your Too Faced palette? So the palette is on TooFaced.com. It's also on Ulta and it's also on Sephora. And Ulta, you can go pick it up in store. I actually went and saw the palette yesterday. It's so pretty. Like it's right when you walk in and I was just like, you have such a huge platform with 6 million on Instagram, 13.2 on million on one of your YouTube channels and 2.9 on the other. You are speaking out, you are using your platform for good to speak to and you know, and also you're so honest and vulnerable and real with your fans. And I think that's why you have such a great fan base behind you because they see the authenticity in you and you know you being so transparent through your hardships through your successes i think that's really something that should be you know you should be so proud of as a creator to use your platform in such a great way thank you so much i mean i try i feel like we as creators we have like a responsibility to do that unfortunately not everyone does that i mean not everyone's on us not everyone tries to help people but that I feel like sometimes the internet is judged too harshly because, you know, there are some people that maybe don't use their platform for the best. Right. But it's okay. I mean, we're humans. Like, humans are on the internet. So. Absolutely. Marielle, yeah. you are such a pleasure to talk to. You have such a great head on your shoulders. And 
congratulations for using your platform for the better, speaking up for your people, and honestly, on all your success and your continued success. For our people. <laughs> our people, there you go. And everyone at home, make sure you guys are checking out Marielle's new documentary out on YouTube now called Secrets. You will not want to miss this. It's a great, great documentary. Also guys, be sure to be giving this video a big thumbs up and subscribing to Sweetie High down below. As always, I'm your host, Sienna Leone, and I will see you guys next video. Bye guys.